Ladies and gentlemen, in this video, we're going to try to pull the secret rare Reshiram and Charizard GX. And I have a pre-release kit to open up, so let's see what we can do. What's up guys, it's EG Webs here, back with another video, coming with another Unbroken Bonds opening. And it is time to open up an Unbroken Bonds pre-release kit, or build and battle kit. I just went to GameStop and bought this a few days ago, so it's pretty cool. Um, it's been like a little while since I've opened up a Broken Bonds, so yeah, I'm not going to waste any time. Let's get right into this. So we have, this comes with four packs, a promo card, a mini deck for pre-release, and then a, a little um, sheet that comes with it that gives you instructions on what you could do with this box at our pre-release kit. A pre-release, however... A broken Bond's been out for like two months now, so the after pre-release kits, after the set is released, the, the pre-release kits come out in stores like Barnes and Noble, GameStop, and I've even seen them in Target. So let's get into this right now. Here we go. We just have to slide it out, and I'm not sure where the promos are. Don't know what is good. I'll take any promo that we, that is given to us, and. It is Volcanion. That's a pretty cool one. Unbroken Bonds. Sun and Moon Power number 179. There, that is everything. The contents in the pre-release kit is out. Here is the little slip that comes with it. It gives a, a description of the set. And then it also has a bunch of little tips that it has. Like a 23 card evolution pack. It tells you you could take what's in the packs and build within the deck. Of course, I'm not that good at deck building. I'm trying to get in the competitive TCG. I have no one to play, honestly. So, here you go. Here, I'll give away the code card. That's a pretty valuable code card. So, here is the Volcanion. I'm not sure which one's the most valuable. I think the Volcanion Hollow in the set is actually fairly good. It says Flare Starter and High Heat Blast. And there's Welder, another valuable card. Cynthia, value, pretty valuable. Looker, Pokemon Communication. Litten, 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 Torcat, Torcat, Incineroar, a very playable card. I think that goes with Reshizar, maybe. Green's Exploration, wow, all these cards are good. How? Oh, you're not good. Cynthia, that's a good one. Metalcore Barrier, we'll love that. Secret Rare. Got a few of those. Meltan, Riolu. Bunch of Riolus and Lucario, that's a hollow in the set. And then another Lucario. So that is the deck that you get to build. Fighting, Steel, and Fire is the deck there that you get to build. So here we got four packs. We got one of each pack art. Let's uh, start off with Machamp and Marshall. And before I go into the packs, I want to say I'm going to open up this too. This mini binder comes with a mini binder and a pack. One release with every set. So yeah, let's do this. And we started off with a white colored code card. Previous kits have been pretty good to me, so I'll start with saying Psychic. Nope, Fairy. So it's a Cleffa, Porygon 2, Ultra Force Carton Boy, Squirtle, Tedacool, Aeron, Sandshrew, Ghastly, Zubat Reverse, and we have a Full Art. A Janine Full Art. Wow, this is a full art that's very common, but really just the first pack we made it. I saw the bottom border and I thought it was going to be a Rainbow Rare, but it wasn't to be that time. But a Janine Full Art, that is very nice. One of the most valuable full arts in the set is Green's Exploration, which is around $33 last time I checked. Let's do another a Broken Bonds pack. Ooh, we got two white codes. Let's see. Do I feel the back card? I don't know. I feel like this is just gonna be a hollow. With a Dark Energy, Fero, Chargebug, Pukamuku, Oddish, Squirtle, Tentacool, Aeron, Sandshrew. We have a War Turtle Reverse, and it looks to be just a hollow, an Arcanine hollow. Pretty cool right there. Two hits out of the first two packs. Let's see if we get something good. 
out of this Guardi Sylveon pack. And let's flip it over. There, well, I saw the color anyways. So, yeah. There is a Psychic Energy, Frogadier, Rhydon, Wartortle, Caterpie, Clefairy, Poliwag, Glamorekins, Drowsy, sitting in a tree, sitting in a tree, sitting in a tree. Rhyhorn Reverse, and then a Quag C Ray, regular rare, giggity giggity. So, last pack of this pre release kit. Rexy Zard pack. Here's the code for anyone who wants to take it. So, Grass Energy, Dodrio, Eradicate, Weepin' Bell, Geodude, Litten the Kitten, Froki, Crab Rawler, Oddish. The reverse is a Froki that is a common, and the final card is a Licky Licky Regular Rare. So, pretty good pulls out of that pre release kit. We got a Fuller, and then we got a Powell Rare. So we're not open, we're not done yet. We have one booster pack. We have this, the Reshizard binder, and it comes with that. Lucario Melmetal. And then a booster pack. I have not pulled a hollow rare out of any of these binders. I've got every one of them since. Um Let's see, Burning Shadows, I think? Or, I got Guardians Rising and I got Crimson Invasion, so... Let's see, Water Energy, Polyworld, Gloom, Dodrio, Glamiao, Diglett, Poliwag, Inkay, Tentacool, a Charger Bug Reverse, and then... A Mewtwo, not too bad. Still a regular rare. And my streak of getting nothing out of my binders continues. But we did get something out of the pre-release kit. And that's what matters. So here are the two pulls. We got a Arcanine Hollow and then a Janine Full Art. So there you guys go. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. A little bit of a shorter one. Stay tuned for more awesome and epic videos coming soon. Follow my Instagram at EJWeb's YouTube. Follow me on Snapchat at EthanWeber24. Make sure to like and subscribe. Share this video with your friends. Do all that good stuff like I know the EJWeb's does. EJ Webs Nation does. See you guys in the next one. Bye.